Hey guys, it's Final Master Link, and welcome back to Let's Play Kingdom Hearts 3 Blind. And in the last episode, we finished up the training area, which is Mount Olympus, Hercules' world, whatever you want to call it. And so now we're going to, uh, uh, now I, I left it off at the, the last scene bef after this fight actually happened. But due to how it kind of auto-saves, I kind of had to shut off my PS4. So we're going to just just do this real quick. It's not that... won't be that long. Besides, who doesn't want to do this fight again as Riku? Where you're OP as fuck. I mean, look at it. We're just shredding this thing. I mean, look at that. God damn, son. Haven't even taken a hit yet. We're just that badass. What can I say? Oops, I actually didn't mean to do that. Alright. You can probably hear me button mashing in the background, but that's okay. Okay, you did hit me once, I'll give you that one. We almost got him. There we go. And I believe there is one more cutscene I need to skip before we continue on where we were. All right, here we are. Well, I mean, we're only level 7, so what do you expect? Uh, it can't be gone forever. Maybe something will trigger it real soon. Like, what exactly? Hey! Perhaps it could be something that is as simple as that. Wait, you think so too? Whenever you are in need, magic happens. That is your greatest strength, Sora. You make it sound like an accident. <laughs> huh? We're back, Master. Whoa. Oh, oh, wow. You guys are all here. We were here before, but you didn't wait. Hey there, fellas. So, what have you three been up to? We were visiting oh. and to figure out how to get all of Sora's lost powers back. I was a big disappointment. Oh, what a shame. But honestly, you didn't fare any better. Did you manage to figure out where Aqua is? Because Master Yen Sid said that's why you fellas left. Come on, can I finally say something? We know Master Aqua made it as far as the beach that Sora and I once visited, but that's where her trail ends. Meaning? All traces of her vanish into the Great Abyss, beneath the Realm of Darkness. No. Sora was dragged into the abyss during his exam, and I went in after him. 
So I think if we find someone who is really close to Aqua, and they make the dive, they could reach her down there. I'm not sure who's even left to ask. Ventus is hidden, and Aqua's the only one who knows where. Plus, nobody's seen Terra in ages. Aqua was the last. So Aqua, she's gonna be the key to finding all three. Yes, their teacher, Master Erebus, would have been another possibility. Had Xehanort not mercilessly struck him down. Super hard since you don't have the power of waking. Huh? Sorry. I have no idea why that just popped out. Well, it was pretty convincing. Yeah. Better not let us down. Sora, you must focus on regaining your lost power of waking. Mickey and Riku, I recall that Master Aqua journeyed to many worlds and connected with others who could be the link we need. Good plan, sir. Riku and I will retrace her steps and see if we can find any sort of clues. But first... Hmm? We got hit pretty hard in the Realm of Darkness. My Keyblade was damaged, and the Heartless broke Riku's clean in half. So we're gonna need to get replacements before we can continue. In that case, Rendezvous with Kyrie and me. They are continuing their training under the tutelage of the wizard Merlin. Yes, sir. Also, I would like you to deliver these for me. Are they? Yes, they are the same as the ones I gave you. Special vestments to shield Kyrie and me from the darkness. We got them! What? No fair! What about my outfit, Master? Sora, don't bring in more guards. I think I'm finished. Settle down. I have new clothes for you, too, Sora. Yeah? A gift from the good <laughs> fairies. I knew you'd come through for me. Thanks. Those are no ordinary guards, Sora. Like before, they have very special powers. So it took extra time to prepare for them. In addition, there is a gift <laughs> from Chip and Dale inside. Cool. Okay. <laughs> Happy now? Yep. Oh, you are all ready to proceed. Hey, wait! Don't forget about me! Jiminy! Every journey worth going on needs a cricket to keep track of it. And I can't let you start this one without old Jiminy Cricket by your side. The whole team's back. Yeah. Good. Now to mark the beginning of a new journey. I wish for you to have this, Sora. Okay. That is a heart binder. Think of it as a good luck charm made just for you. You have a gift, Sora, for connecting with others. This makes that gift stronger. It's time to go. So yeah, this thing, uh, it's, it's talking about something like with the link command. <clears throat> I'm guessing that's used to like, you know, for summons or whatever. Not entirely sure what it's about. Man, look at those HD gummy blocks on our ship, huh? Gorge. 
Notice how he, changing his clothes changed his hairstyle too. I guess they must be magic. Oh, it's sexy on. I guess we haven't spoken since the castle. I'm Yenzo. Alias is here too. Alexius. Alias. Whatever's between you and Roxas, it's in the past. Zora, the reason we're here is because you and your friends defeated our nobodies, thereby recompleting us. We cast off our hearts by choice. Zemnis? Oh, he's with Thaum. Not anymore. Zemnis and Xehanor have no hold over us now. We're just students of the Lara. Exactly the same as we were before all of this began. Hmm. But you know, now that I think about it, Axel's on our side now. In that spirit, Sora, we found some intriguing data in the bit of code we deciphered. Is it about me? Yes. In order to piece your memories back together, our teacher Ansem the Wise took a close look at your heart. And what he found is that your heart doesn't belong just to you. <laughs> You don't seem surprised. Belongs to Ven, fools. Yeah. Honestly, I suspected as much. There's another heart inside mine. I think it's Roxas's. Just like Namine is still inside Kyrie's. Interesting. Well, no one knows your heart better than you. To be honest, we still have a plethora of questions on our side. But, the idea has merit. It's incredible enough that you and your nobody are able to coexist. If you share a heart, no wonder someone as remarkable as you caught Ansem the Wise's eye. We'll keep investigating based on your hypothesis. I'll be in touch. find Roxas and save him. The others are following Aqua's heart. So I'll follow Roxas's heart. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. 
trust the guidance that your heart gives you, Sora. That's what Master Yen Sid said. <laughs> oh, that's easy. Okay, now we start Kingdom Hearts 3 proper. That's sweet. Okay, gummy foam. It's it's a cell phone. That's really what it is. It can take pictures. Oh my god. God, that's so fancy, isn't it? Man, I wish I had a device that could do that. So I am I am curious to see what exactly the new gummy ship is about. Okay, so you can press L1 or R1 to start thrusting forward. And you can do a U-turn by pushing L2 or L3 or whatever. You can use circle for a boost, and you can press options for help. Okay, you can attack with the gummy ship using either square or R2. You can avoid danger by rolling. Dual barrel roll. And we look for world markers, HP. HP and the boost gauge is what we should keep an eye on. And the gummy radar, which detects nearby Heartless. Okay. Yeah, but I, yeah, I heard it was kind of like a more open world sort of exploration thing. I guess kind of like Star Fox, in a sense. Okay, I guess that's money. Money rings here. Let's destroy some shit, I guess. Oh, okay. So we get four different things. The first is EXP points, and then HP, and then items and unique items. Okay. I can probably remember that. Okay, I think that thing over there is a heartless. Let's go check it out, I guess. What the fuck are those things? They look kind of like warp gates. Gates. Well, shouldn't we break these things up? What is that? A fire G? Oh, I see. It's a nebula lane. There's also a boost spheres and boost rings. Okay. Well, that's cool. I want to. I want to catch that. Okay. Yeah. Gummy. Gummy battle? Yeah, I wanted to see that Heartless there. Let's go to it, I guess. Oh, so you go to a different sort of arena. Huh. Okay, L moves your ship around. Hold square R2 for firing. Gotta look at your score. Gotta know the enemy's defeated and your battle rank. And the higher it is, the better the rewards. Okay. Cool. I guess... Mm, I'm not quite sure what the multiplier is. I guess that's how many times you... Uh, I wonder how high you can get, actually. I assume it goes up by not taking damage or something. I don't know. Okay, I mean, I can, you know, this is kind of fun, kind of. I have a rank B, so that's good, right? Oh, damn. Oh. I was about to say, did I run out of time? I think I did. Well, I got a B, so that's cool, right? I got a light M, a button S, and a marble M, and I got 3,600 XP points. Cool. I guess let's, uh, fuck around a bit more, get some more, get some more money. I wonder if that's separate from the money on our person. I guess I can't 
I guess I can't tell that. I don't want to do another battle. Let's just go over here for now. And there are more of those rings there. Let's check that out. Treasure spheres. Contain rare items just waiting to be unlocked. Okay, you gotta shoot the sphere. Connect the circuits. Locate the... Locate the one gears, then keep shooting at them until you fully rotate them, rotate them into position and connect the circuits. Keep your eyes peeled. Some gears are dummies that don't actually do anything. And if you successfully connected all the circuits, the treasure sphere will unlock. Okay. I mean, that sounds like fun to me. Shoot the gears to rotate them and connect everything. Alright. Um, like... Like this one? Oh, I see. That makes sense. I gotcha. Okay, so it's like a puzzle. Okay. Well, this is neat. I wonder if there are crazy-ass boss battles you can get into. You know, like I said, supposedly the the creators of Einhander worked on this aspect of the game. They were like consultants, I guess. So what do we get? We got a lot of XP. We got Fire G, and we got Blizzara G, and we got Water G, Booster G, Propeller G, and Roman? Roman 1 G? Okay. Cool. You know, this is this is kind of neat. Let me get some a little bit of XP up there. I see it. You know, eventually I'll have to make a badass ship, of course. I don't know if I'll put that on video, though. Should probably go to the marker. I think it was... Okay, it was saying over there. Okay, the boost is pretty neat. Ooh, I should probably avoid those. More XP. Oh, you got things on the wall here. Okay. I don't, I don't suppose we can destroy those crystals, can we? I guess just the ones floating above here. They kind of remind me of the crystals from, like, the Final Fantasy games. Maybe that was the... Maybe that's kind of the joke. Do these hold on to those, or... Or what? See another crystal there. Let's go ahead and stop. Oh, I got a blueprint fragment. Blueprint fragments can be found scattered across the ocean between. Collect all the fragments in a set and you'll be rewarded with a valuable special plus blueprint. To claim your reward, press options and then select information gummy missions. Okay, cool. Yeah, it does. this does kind of seem like an open world sort of Star Fox game. Now, let me go ahead and take care of these guys first. I, I really should just go to the dam where I need to go over here. Look at all that XP, Jesus. I'm already level 5, bitches. Oh, yeah, that definitely looks like Twilight Town, doesn't it? Whoa, bitch. Damn. Alright, um... I think that's good for this episode. Oh, that's not what I wanted. I think that's good for this episode. I think I'm just gonna end it off here for now and go to Twilight Town next episode. So that'll be all for this video. Thanks for watching, guys.